St. Edmund has some strong athletes returning, but the same can be said for Opelousas High. Definitely. They're, they're building the foundation. Starting off last year in 2021, the Tigers battled with adversity through injury early on, forcing head coach Jimmy Zachary to start 14 freshmen. But things you take a risk doing it every time you know you start that many freshmen, you know, a lot that's not heard of anywhere. Uh, but you know, you take the risk with you know the reward of being you know seasoned, they have more experience, they they took their bumps, you know, as freshmen, and you know, you're trying to grow them up fast. And so, you hopefully, these guys grow up and you know, we take pick up from where we left off. I was, I was spooked basically, <laughs> it started me like that's crazy, but as I mean. I had the shoes to fill. I was I'm the guy. Things were a little shaky in the first half of the season as the guys grew from boys to men quickly. But 2021 showed a glimmer of hope for Opelousas as they finished the season six and six, making a second round playoff appearance. Now they return 18 starters total, where a top strength is experience. Their roster is full of young players on paper, but on the field is a different story. Zachary is confident his team can compete with the best of the best. You know, being as young as they are, you know, we have size, we have strength, you know, we have speed. But I don't think sometimes they look at another opponent, the opponent, and look at them like, oh, they big. No, y'all big too. You know, so that's that's one of the things we've been preaching this summer. Know who you are. This year, a team, like, we know, like, our job now, like, because becoming, like, an incoming freshman, like, you would just, like, you ain't know, like, your job. But now, like, we learning the game of, like, how high school football really is. Being pleased. I'm going to be a problem this year. But last year I wasn't as good, but this year I'm going to be a problem. And in competing with the best of the best, Seth Opelousas opens their schedule to Turlings, a non-district team that they lost to in the, in the past two years. 